Atticunnel Peter, Benineto-based Apostle Johnson Suleiman has dragged Festus Kiamo, San, before the Nigerian Bar Association over an alleged public statement he made against him concerning one Stephanie Otobo. Suleiman alleged that Kiamo tried to smear his name through the media, and therefore wants the court to sanction Kiamo. Ms. Otobo had, last year, alleged that she had an amorous relationship with Apostle Suleiman who had reneged his promise to marry her. Counsel to Suleiman, Oleiwa Akolabi, told journalists in Benin on Sunday that Kiamo failed to handle the matter professionally and also refused to respond to letters sent to him by Suleiman, prompting the preacher to petition the NBA. According to F.O. Labby, Kiamo made spurious allegations against his client, sometime on March 3, 2017. He noted that Otoba later tendered public apology to Suleiman, but Kiamo has still not retracted his public statements against Suleiman. F.O. Labby said, while Kiamo made a demand on our client supposedly on the brief of Stephanie Otobo, our client was, ordinarily, the addressee of the said letter. However, our client had hardly received an acknowledged receipt of the letter when he followed up with a petition to the Inspector General of Police and an organized media attack on our client. As widely accepted in the legal sphere, an addressee of a letter ought to have taken receipt of it before any supposed action would be taken on it, but in this instance, not only did he make it a subject of media gossips, he engaged in active conversations in the public sphere through print and other media on the matter for which our client had no opportunity to debunk the allegations. Meanwhile, the secretary of the Nigerian Bar Association, NBA, Jonathan Gunutaiti, has directed Suleiman to within 21 days forward to it a statement sworn before a competent court. The NBA in a statement dated 29 January 2019, directed Suleiman to include in his statement, any witness he may wish to call with concise statement of material facts to be relied upon in support of the petition, with other relevant documents. The NBA said this would enable it to take a decision on the petition. Download the Punch News app now on.